That's why many Christians are suffering because of Gilai. One will live with her husband in a Gilway, living with his wife in a Gilway. That's why I testified to last month. I used to live Gilly in my house. I'm full of sourness every time. The shepherd of the Lord in Kitale. He says some demons you take to the preachers are not cast out. It's your wife or your husband to cast them out. But you are living a gay life. What you bring to Mama, the preacher? My husband is doing this and this and this and this and this. Have you ever sat her down and told her? Have you ever told him, brother, this man will speak, I'm tired with. And the life we live is not okay for me. You go and complain to the preacher. And maybe he's not aware. The meaning is you're living again. Okay, when you leave this crusade in Italy, everybody to tell his wife, cast the demons out of me. Or oh, my husband, cast out the demons out of me. Because we were in a seminar for the preachers and the church assistant. I took that word. And you saw I'm living again like so many days. And I'm full of murmuring against my wife. That's why I asked me it's not healed. Nothing good coming my way. Sicknesses to our children because where bitterness is nothing good will happen I carried that word from Kitale I never left it there I came with it to my home here again he said the, of the intention when you have peace don't, don't talk at a time you have violent. and I waited after we've eaten we had peace and I told her wait first sit here now I want today you cut the demons out of me. Business. And I was so serious. She said, casting the devil meaning, your partner to tell you, where are you getting him or to Where are you wrong unto her? What does she feel doesn't edify her? Okay. Now I told her, cast the demons out of me. I'm rejecting to live a good life now. Okay. She said, no. I can't lay my hand on you. I said, not your hand. Tell me. In the life we live in the house here, where am I offending you? Where am I making mistakes? Okay. Oh, so that is the case. I am God. Now wait. Now she talked a lot. She said a lot. She said a lot. Okay. Till I saw. So that is. And she has never told me that. She, she said, said a lot of very petty things. Mm -hmm. You're offending me here, this matter mm here. -hmm. This mm -hmm. this mm -hmm. Who make this If I tell you, mm -hmm. the whole, the handle is not mm -hmm. You say, I lose that. There are men in the homes. The whole is not in a proper manner. At least adjusting, you say that's not your work. Yet this offending her, it gets her to bitterness. We don't see peace at home. The children are weak every time. We are living a gay life, blaming each other. You say you're a mason, I say I'm a mason, yes. And I tell you the timber is breaking down here. You say I'm a mason. When you wake up, you go to church. When you come back, it's already late. You go back to church and come late. So I get to a stool and hit the timber. Or I shake down all the termites. Suppose I break my arm. What do you have? And that is the work of men. So such a things are getting me to business. Normally I question which man will come and do this work. Okay. In my mouth, from the time I was born, I never apologized to anyone. 
I tell who to forgive. My own father could not have forgiven me. Because I feel it's wrong. Now, a woman, I tell her, forgive me. But that day, when she said all, I told her, forgive me. And from today, I'll be working hard. Ah, okay. I felt the calmness in my soul. She also oh. said, they cast the demons out of me. Watch. So I had a heap of stuff with me. I tell her, in fact, you are God. I used to, to go to Kitale. When I'm sent to Kitale to preach, I think of not coming back home. Why? And these are very petty things. That's why whenever when I come, bridge, when I'm close to a home, as my staff, I've been well father. But after two weeks, when I'm, I'm close to a home here in Waybridge, when you come home, you must be happy. The joy is tough there. Because I'm I'm reminded all your offenses, and I don't speak up. When I come and put down yeah. my bag, I start breathing yeah. in congestion. Okay. Where you come from, are you ill? I say no. When I get to the house, I feel low breath in the house. and the windows are there. But the chest starts in congestion breathing. I'll sleep ill that night. And where you come from, why you yeah, in? Man, they, they, they just they started once I got into the house. So I told her for me this and this and this yeah, matter. Man, no, so you are bitter because of this. Time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She too, to from the time you married me, to say forgive me, Marufuku. totally no. Because everybody feels the other two who are living a gay life. She also said, now, I'm also saying, sorry. I too from today, I'll be diligent. The house was healed from that day. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. That's why don't be pleased to take the word and keep. Take and put into action. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I took them and put into action. It saved me. I saw the house very quiet. And the children were not cheerful. I saw life coming in. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I saw peace coming in. Should you take it? Don't say it was said in Kitale only. You'll see peace coming in your home. But, guiltless. That's what he says. One covering a mistake is seeking favor. But one who rebukes something separated very friends. 